All right, so what's up, guys? We are going to start the Ice Academy stream. Last week, we did um, how to aim, how to improve your aim, how to become a better CSGO player aim-wise. And this time, I'm going to explain, try to explain how to use it. So this time, I'm going to explain how you can peek, what is the best way to peek, uh, what is the best way to entry a site, um, just general things uh, to get in a site. Um, because I reckon that a lot of you guys like just like buy the P90 and like YOLO rushes uh, in a site. And the only thing a CT needs to do is hold an angle and just like tap you away. Uh, that's that's pretty simple. Um, so I'm going to uh, explain B. I'm going to explain A long and maybe short. I'm not sure yet, but I'm definitely going to explain B and I'm definitely going to explain A long. Uh, we're going to start with B. We're going to choose an AK. Uh, we have 11 bots. I want 21. Can I get 21? I. Now you know what? Let's let's hit up five. That's seven. I need five. Not seven. I want five. All right. I don't know why I have seven, but it's fine. All right. Um. So the timer starts. I have a timer. Um. I'm not gonna look at it. But there are some ways to uh to to peek. Um, I don't. I'm not sure. Can these bots shoot at me? No, they will only. They will only peek. All right, let's restart it then. Normal. Let's hit up strong bots. Can they shoot me? Yes, they can. Okay. So I have a danger here to uh, to get shot as well. So that's the thing. So we're gonna play this with five bots. Um, I wanna. Can I restart this shit? Oh. Then let's hit up strong. Then let's hit up. All right. So um, let's pretend we are late in a round. So let's pretend that um, we hit up a first, but. They had us on lockdown, so we couldn't get through. We didn't get through. Um, so we need to rotate to B, and we are not sure if they have pushed B, yes or no. So we need to clear basically every angle. Um, at the beginning of the round, you can basically uh, rush up to here um, until you will have enemy contact. Um, and most of the times when you uh, rotate back to uh, B or you hit B like in the beginning of the round, um, oh, I don't have, wait, blind space, oh, space, no, I cannot type for shit, can I, okay, there you go, um, most of the times, um, when you start here, someone can look up this angle, so it's, that's no big deal, um, but for now, let's pretend that we have to rotate back, so, what we have to do is, like, clear every, every angle, so maybe they were holding here, so I have to jiggle peek it, what is jiggle peeking? Jiggle peeking is is very simple. Like um, you hit a strafe, so you hit, for example, I go to right, so I hit D for now. But what I don't do is I do a shoulder peek. So I will only peek the angle that he can be at. This is clear. That's clear. So for example, he's here. He will stand here to hold that angle from here, where you see a lot of guys do. The only thing you need to do is like jiggle peek. And if you're not comfortable enough with your aim, you can like jiggle peek, he's there, and then, for example, fall back, wait for your teammates or whatever. Or you can do pre-fire, you can like sidestep shots. So, for example, uh, maybe someone is lower, so you jiggle peek, no one is here, alright, that's clear. So the first angle you need to be careful about is this angle right here. Um, a lot of guys will stand here, uh, on, on B, on, on dust too. So what I do is like a jiggle peek, alright, so it's clear, so I go to the next one. The next one is box. Of course, there are other angles, but these are the most common angles. So, we'll go to the next one, and that's barrel. Barrel's clear. Then go up to high. There is one. Hop. Tap. I saw him. I jiggle peek. I saw him. I tap right away. I killed him. As you can see, I don't do this. I'm like, all right, everything is clear. Uh, let me see. I, all right. It's clear. Let's go, OB. No, what I do is, like, I go step by step. 
bit by bit, and just work my way in. As you can hear, you cannot you cannot even hear me. So if you do it if you do it good, you cannot hear me. Um, I don't know if it has a head yes or no. That is a head. I don't know if I can hit it from here. No, but he's behind box, so I can call that behind box. There you go. That's the kill. So. Um, next spot is what is common is like this this angle right here. No one's here. Next one, nothing. Lock up. Be close. Nothing. So the next angle, if I walk up, if if I can I, if I walk up, there you go. That's what I meant. If I walk up and I go straight here, people from uh, guys from uh, window can see me. On the window, even door door is peeking me right now. So what I do is I do a close peek, I go back, and then I peek window. So I peek under window, and then I peek window. So window is here, as you can see, I tap him, and he's gone, he's out. So I go further, door. Sometimes it takes you a couple of shots, that's fine. Then peek, then check the whole corner, because if you only peek like this, he can still be in this corner. Can I go without, yeah. He can still be in this corner, and you're like, uh, yeah, but it's clear. And then you go around the corner and it's 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 done, you know? So you go here. Check like this. He's probably there. You, you never You never challenge door basically. So what I see you do a lot of guys, what a lot of guys do. Alright, so this is the angle I was talking about. So he's there, he's holding an angle. The only thing I need to do is like jiggle peek, so side sidestep peek. That shit comes very in handy in um, the aim training as well, like with all the red dots. Uh, that's very, very helpful. So check lower, lower clear. Go to the next one, next spot is clear. All right, so he's there. Normally, when there is an op, you don't challenge it. You like, you you jiggle peek, so you shoulder peek, you hear an op shot, I'm out of this bitch. Or what you can do is like, use flashes and shit or whatever, use a smoke and go for it that way. But otherwise, I would recommend if you're just an AK, I won't go for it. If you're playing against good players, don't go for it. So, barrels, next one. Clear. Alright. So, there is a slight... A slight... That possibility that he is here. No, he's not. Door clear. Probably car. That's the next, yeah. He shouldn't, he shouldn't peek like that. That's pretty stupid. He should not peek like that. Normally, when, when someone is holding this angle, they will, they will hold this angle until they will, will go. Um, you can, you can try to do that, like, when, when he's an upper and he's holding that angle. Let me see if I can clear the shit with an up. So if I only have one left, all right. So there was one here. I saw his gun. I saw another gun. All right. So uh, it's there. That's that one. That's a hit as well. All right. That's the danger of uh, only close peek. Wait, what? All right. So he's there. I saw a head here. Do I still? I still do. I can't kill me, he's too far away. There you go. I wanna get to that point. I can okay, so one is there, one is there. Alright, fine. So I got one split lap, T's here. There you go. Alright. So when I'm holding with my arm right here, and you like shoulder peek, and I miss my shot. You you can bet that I like change positions like go right here and then peek up and then try to to hit you to hit you um, But you're wide open like is a, an opera has an advantage here um, The only difference between an opera and an AK in this situation is that if you control your AK enough so For example a bot is there. I can like I only need one shot to hit but the the the, the danger here is like you have like two pixels uh maybe the size of my crosshair gap like head wise you can hit so you your aim has to be pretty damn good to um to hit that shot 
And as you can see, I have like more than three pixels or a uh, crosshair get wise to, to hit him. So there are a couple of angles you can you can peek, you can hold. So again, if you go in, it's very important to uh, like not commit very hard. If I commit very hard, so for example, he was lower and I commit very hard and I was I was holding here. The only thing he needed to do is like track me back. So I w walked up. So I have this angle and I have that angle to uh, to hit him. But if I walk up and I, I'm right here and I, I miss my shots, you can bet I die. Sometimes against an upper, if you're playing against an up who's not that great, um, a wide peak is sometimes necessary because it's unexpected. But if you play against the hardcore upper, look, this is the only, do you see what, what I have to shoot? So for example, when he was holding an op, when he had an op, Trust me, if I peek like that, like three, four times, I, I would have, I would have been a goner. That's for sure. All right, so uh, let's let's go too long now. So when you have long, like, let's hit a five. Um, let's do up first. So, can I walk back? I can. So, um, let's pretend that we hit B. Um, didn't go very well, so we had to rotate back. Um, so, there's a slight chance that they are everywhere. Right, so the first angle you have to watch, you have to peek, if the, is, is this angle. I'm lagging. I don't know why, but I'm lagging. Uh, is this angle. Exactly, like shoulder peak and then again Dengaray. That's that's right, April. Alright, so um there are a couple of angles you need to Oh, he's not there. That's kinda weird. Like the there are a couple of angles you need to worry about on long. What I usually do is I um check this corner. So when it's clear, I'll go for this corner. And this is a very important corner. This corner can make or break your push at um This corner right here, can I can I safely I'm lagging the fuck? Do you see that? So Oh crap. This corner can make your make or break what is going on? Let me let me check what is going on guys. I'm a little bit laggy, I don't know why. I don't like it. Kind of weird. All right, I don't know what's going on, but it's fine. Um, this corner can make or break your push. So, for example, when I'm hold, what, uh, if I'm holding this angle, um, you have to flash. If you don't flash, you're fucked. Um, um, there are a couple of ways to flash it. I'm not gonna explain it now. Um, I think it's more important to to know how to peek in certain situations because you don't always have a flash with you. You don't always have a smoke with you. So, um, you, ne you cannot always rely on smoke or a flash. So, um, let's, let's restart this round. Let's hit it, let's hit it up with 10 bots so I have more angles to cover. So, um, that's the first angle, that's the second angle I'm gonna peek, that's the third one. There you go. See how simple it is, how, how effective it can be. So, for example, um, he's holding at an angle with an M4. You can sometimes a, pe a person will stay. A pre fire is always welcome. So if you go there, pop, just like a quick, quick pre fire, boom. And 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 it's as you can see, like the bullet spread is like if you if you do it right, it's like it's it's dead on, it's perfect. So when when he's holding an angle, you can like, I always pre fire it. If I win an op, I'm always. Oh, that was a bad one. I always pre-fire or maybe even shoulder peek like to bait out that shot when he shoots like I'm holding an angle and just 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 go for it all right so next thing um, what I think is important is this angle right here as you can see when I peek like this 
And they're only here when you're... Oh, oh crap. I forgot that they're there. <laughs> That's stupid. Alright. So, again. Okay, look. He's holding that angle. Oh my god, I didn't expect him to shoot me. So, he's still there. And if you, if you just place it right, like... You know where to hit your aim. You know... It's 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 a feeling you develop over time. Um, so don't always aim on head level. Never aim on 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 their feet. That's that's something that's let's put on God mode by the way. Um, so yeah, that's an off angle. They will never stand there. That's well, they will sometimes stand there, but it's like a very off angle. I don't know. Um, but again, like I expected him, him to be here. Like, like a lot of guys will do. Oh crap. I'm, I'm still lagging. I don't know why. But I'm still lagging. Um, sometimes it will stand here. Or in, indeed here. Um, but you, it, just think about that, that they're, that you're playing against just like normal players who don't play that aggressive. That's... Let's take it just very easy right now. Um, so the first angle, he's there. There you go. Second one, he's not there. Right, so we're gonna check out for more. There you go. Check out this angle. There you go. Check out pit. And as you can see, I'm jiggle peeking. So I'm stepping one by one. I'm not going fully in. I just step by step. The first thing I do when... Um, I get hit by a flash, or for example, one is standing there and he flashes, and I'm completely blind. What I do is I don't walk back. If I go with my teammates, I don't walk back, but I go through. If I get shot, if I get killed, fine, but don't block my teammates. So I walk right here, hope that I survived. I survived, so I can hold this angle right now. Nine out of ten times, my teammates will hold this angle, will walk up while, I will, while I'm holding this angle. So... He's dead, and my teammates will hold that angle. Crap, that was a bad spray. Holy crap. It's not FPS-wise. FPS is, FPS is fine. Um, so yeah, the next thing, what is very important, uh, is, an, is an angle that a lot of you guys will be. Um, I don't recommend it to be an angle for you. Um, is is the angle right here? Um, because if you miss your first shot as an opera and you get pushed, you you lose the advantage. So what I usually do is like I fall back to an angle I can I can rely on. I can miss a shot and then re peek. Um, but that's up to you guys. All right. So um, smokes and everything is going to be for the next one. Um, but you can throw your smoke. Take the angle right there. He's gone. You can walk up, it's... It's it's almost a perfect smoke, uh, for that matter. Look, that's an angle. That's kinda weird. I'm just going right through it. I don't give a crap if, if they're here. I'm just gonna go plow through it. Alright, so... You were left off, so... Um... Smoke! What the fuck? Up from where? Oh my god, I'm such a noob. I'm gonna cut that out. No, I'm not. <laughs> that was so bad. Alright, so, uh, next thing. What I think is important is... Um, what I usually do... What I, I'm gonna leave him there. Um, what I usually do... Oh crap, there's another one. Fuck. I thought there was only one left. What I usually do is I... Um, Uh, more. No, we're gonna leave him there. All right. So we threw the smoke. We threw everything. Blah blah blah. Yada yada yada. All right. So what I usually do? Where he is? Last one is there. Okay. Oh, no, he's not the last one. Alright, so what I usually do is I don't pick up like this, because that's an angle uh, they will hold. What I usually do is I jump up like this. So, if you if short is clear, I will jump up like this. 
So I immediately have this angle right here. If they're not there, I can walk up like that. So I can... Um, it's an it's an harder spot to be, but that's what I do. That's what I prefer. A lot of guys will not approve of that. So they're like, are you stupid? That's not something you do. Uh, but that's fine. It works for me. And if it works, it works. Alright, so they're there. That's all. That's something that works for me and always has. Um, so I, that's something I like to do. He's not there this time, right? So I jump up. Hold this angle. Right there. It's clear. And maybe then do this. Or maybe even just like walk up. And then hold that angle. Uh, make sure you just like clear every spot. You, you don't leave anything by chance. Like, oh, he wouldn't be there. Uh, it's it's very important to clear everything. Uh, of course, the moment I, I buy my op. Sometimes I do that. That was not a good pre-aim. I haven't played AWP lately. So my op, my AWP angles are a little bit off, but... Um, we'll get the hang of it eventually. It's just very important to, to cover every angle. Like, what I used to do, what I like to do, what I think is very funny to do, or very funny, very smart to do, like, walk up, like, and pre-aim pre this angle right here. I don't know if that's a person, yes or no? No, it's a barrel. Oh, oh my god, I thought it was a, I thought it was a knee or something. Um, but what do you, what, most times you will see, like, uh, a guy twitching around behind the box, and you can, like, easily just spam right through it. Um, they won't expect it, that, that's an angle. I will if oh crap he's still there my god so that's one please be ct there you go thank you oh crap no 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 I don't want to die no 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 I want to I want to show something thank you all right so you will see a guy hold here and maybe hold this angle right here then won't expect you to be here um they they usually will hold this angle right here or maybe even just like sit like this and hold short. Because someone from CT is holding that angle and he's like holding short. Um, he thinks he's not visible, but he, his gun will stick out. Like an M4 or whatever. And he will slip up and I will see see, see his gun. And then just like line, line, line everything up like arm. Alright, so here's his head. Shoot him. They usually blame you for wall for walls. But it's, 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 it's just you being the smart ass, you know. Um, oh my god, I lagged him. Really? Maybe not even. Um, but it's, it's, oh my god, what? I don't know. It's, um, that's, it's something what I do, what I like to do, is when I peek up, it's like, jump on this barrel, instead of like, going over it. Um, it's risky, but... What I what I th think, I don't know why, but I think this is faster, so I can hold this angle more clearly and then just like turn around and then turn back, um, instead of like looking here, then go here, or maybe even here, then there, then here. It's something that I like to, I like to do. Um, I don't know why that is, but I just I just like it to do that to do it like that. Are there any questions, by the way, so far? With the... With everyone? Or is everything pretty clear? Is he standing in here? Look, he is. Um, look how overpowered that angle is. Um, you can shoot through the box very easily. It's not that hard. Oh, rip. Um, the only thing I have to say is use each other. So use your use your flashes, use your utility, use each other, and not in a way like bait each other, but like in a way um, 
help each other out. If if I'm holding this angle, let a teammate of yours hold this angle. You know, like so you can cover pretty much every angle right away. Come on, just die. I need glasses. That's for sure. Wait, what? All right. All right. So, um, of course, you have another way, another way to peek, another way to hold an angle, another way to to play aggressive on on uh, different on different maps. But this is the most common way to do it. Um, I wanna I wanna show you guys one more thing before I uh, am done for today. So I'll go to custom. There's one more thing I want to show. One more thing I want I want I want to show you guys. All right, so we go to short. Let's do short very quick. It's like very basic, very quick. Here's one. There's one probably. There you go. Um, I'm still lagging. Don't know why. Oh my god, there are three here. What the fuck? All right, so. I got two left. All right, so oh, I got more than two left. I'm still lagging like as fuck. I Do you guys see this? Holy shit! All right, so um, just die. All right, how many left? Three left, all right. So, um, you're in this situation. So, um, you think site is clear or you cleared site. So, for example, I'm gonna throw a Molotov uh, to be sure that no one is behind the boxes. Again, every smoke, every Molotov, every nade, I'm gonna explain later, all right? So, site is clear. Um, there's, a, there's a slight chance that Goose is not clear. That's a terrible nade, but Goose is not clear. And uh, as you can see, here is one. So what a lot of you guys do is like they rush in and like go for it like without balls and then have to sit crap I have to stand still I'm one HP I'm gonna put on god mode. Um, the better way to do it like for example if you don't know if there's an op or you know there is an op don't like go full aggressive. Go step by step. So clear every every angle. So there's one. There you go. Clear car. So car is down. I clear the rest. See, he's there. If if he was holding an up, dude, I would have been gone. He will hold. He would have hold that angle. Can I do this shit? I can. That's nice. Appreciate that. They cannot kill me. I can kill them, but they cannot kill me. Like that. All right. There you go. Oh. Oh shit. Clear of the angle. Yeah, I know. I didn't expect him to be here. I just wanted to show you something real quick. Let's put on God mode again. Come on. What else have we got? Is that everything? There's everything. Alright, so for example, when I'm holding his angle, when I'm a CT player and I know they're they break through short. What I do is I hold this angle. Oh crap, where? Oh shit. What I do is I hold this angle. Uh, because nine out of 10 times, they will like just like plow through without even watching. So I can just sit here, stand still, and like just shoot them all off. But what if I tell you that at the moment you go in, they were probably there. The moment you go. The moment you go in, and he's holding that angle, and I'm jiggle peeking, so I'm I'm shoulder peeking. This is not basically this is not shoulder peeking, but like I'm jiggle peeking, and he thinks that I'm plowing through, and he makes his shot, and he misses. I can like get it get in the angle that he has to peek me, if he has to peek me, he has to peek me now. So I can just like sit here, wait up, and like, all right, thank you for the kill. It's very simple. But you, it's it's simple but very effective. But you you know what you have to do or how to do it. 
I think that's the most important part. So, um, again, like there are a lot of angles uh, to cover here. Again, I'm jiggle peeking. Uh, that's an, that's better to to shoot too many times than than not enough. And sometimes it's not it's better to not not to challenge, you know. Sometimes it's better just to when there's someone here or somewhere behind barrels and you're like, all right, aim wise today, aim wise I'm not the not the best. I didn't warm up pretty uh, like I used to, but if if your aim is not on point that day and you're like, oh, I don't have the confidence, just fall back. Don't don't repeat, don't re challenge because if you lose that battle, you'll you'll be down a person, you know. Like to aim is is not on point. I'm too dragging too much with my aim down. I just need to to one tap. I know that. That's something I have to work. Still have to work on. And don't crouch too fast, guys. I see a lot of guys like, oh, there's one. Go up, go up, go up. Oh, there's one. Oh, there's one. Oh, there's one. There's one. Like, just unbind control for a game, for example. And now, of course, I have to hold, like, peek, like, every angle. Um, when you play with your team, like, everyone can hold a different angle. But that's of course something that's uh that's a given. I I need glasses real bad. But yeah, that's basically how you uh Oh my god. That's terrible. So let's 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 quit for today. But yeah, that's basically how you how you can apply the aim with with the peak like the pre the pre aims. The And of course what's something with pre fires. It's very important to know where your crosshair has to be. Um so this is also a little bit of Crosshair placement, always a aim at head level, never aim at feet. Um, you have to drag your aim up, uh, but that's for next uh, for next time. All right, guys, I want to thank you everyone so much for watching. Uh, I'm done for today. I hope this uh, this stream was uh, was helpful and that you guys um, will rank up as soon as possible. But again, everything takes time. Everything will. Um, you have to train a lot before you can uh, improve. So keep that in mind. You will you will not rank up like three ranks in in one week of training unless you play like a uh, hundred hours a week. Maybe then you will like uh, rank up that fast. But otherwise, just think of um, just think of like this like. It's it's like learning how to how to ride a bike. You have to do it a lot. You have to fall a lot. You have to hurt yourself a lot before eventually you will learn how to how to ride it. This is basically the same thing. You have to train a lot. You will lose a lot. You you get frustrated a lot, but eventually you will see that you are improving. So yeah. All right. That's enough for me for now. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you all in the next episode of Ice Academy stream. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you later.